Hey guys! Alright, so um, I did a video showing you how I blow dry my hair. So um, I wanted to talk about the products that I use in my hair. Um, kind of my like daily routine. Well, it's not really a daily routine, seeing as how I only wash my hair like twice a week. I know that sounds gross, but that's just the way my hair is. My hair can last that long, so um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and show you what I use on like a daily basis or a weekly basis. <laughs> um, okay, so for shampoo, I switch my shampoo a lot. Um, Depending, I just like to try new things. Right now, I am using a color treated shampoo because um, before I cut my hair, I got my style like this. I had a bunch of highlights in it. I went back to my natural. So, I've colored it twice since then. The first time, it's just because I had so many highlights that the color faded so easily. And I still use some color to shampoo, but I just needed to retouch it just to kind of refresh it. So, um, for color treated shampoo that I'm using right now is... I love the way it smells. I think that's kind of what sold me on it. Um, it's Catwalk TG. And it's called Fashionista Shampoo Safe for Color. So I'm using this. And then the conditioner that goes along with it. So, using these two, and it smells like grapes. It's delicious. Like, I love washing my hair just for that reason, just because of the way it smells. And it's so moisturizing, and my color looks amazing still. I did my color, I want to say, almost a month ago, and it still looks amazing. Like, I still, it's still dark. So, um, that's what I use on an all-the-time basis. Another one of my favorite shampoos, the, the ones that I was using just before that, is the color treated um, Joico K Pack. Amazing. Love. That's one of my favorites. Definitely one of my favorites. But um, I was using that one for so long, I just decided to switch it up and try a new one. So this is the first time I've tried this one, and I love it. And I get like the big, like, liters. They last me for like a year because I don't wash my hair that much. I have a lot of hair, but I don't wash it that much. So it lasted for like a year. But the Matrix one, it's in an orange bottle and it's like a smoothing one. And I love that one because it's so, it just made your hair feel so amazing. So those are my favorites. Um, let's see, Aveda. I love Aveda's Damage Remedy. That one is just really moisturizing. Your hair doesn't even need to be damaged to use it. But that one is just, I love the way it feels. Um, and then also Aveda Color Conserve, that one's a really good one. But I just want to try this one, and I'm in love with it. love with the smell, love the way it feels. And then um, every, like, I would say maybe like five shampoos, I use a deep conditioner. So my favorite one, or one of my favorites that I'm using right now is this Joico K-Pack. And it's a deep penetrating reconstructor. Um, it smells amazing too. Can't even explain what this one smells like, but it smells so good. And it makes your hair feel amazing. I just put it in the ends, like when I shampoo it. After I shampoo and condition it, then while I'm in the shower, I put it in my hair. Sometimes I'll wear it even longer. Sometimes when I'm out of the shower, then I'll leave it on for like 20 minutes and then rinse it out. And it makes your hair feel so good. So, um, so that's what I use, like, every fifth shampoo. And then, when I get out of the shower, I always spray my hair with the leave-in conditioner. And I've tried quite a few. The one I'm using right now is called, it's a 10 Miracle Leave-In Conditioner. I don't, I've never used any of these other products, but, um, I like this one. Smell is good, it makes your hair feel good, and it, um, I use this mostly for, like, detangling, to protect my hair from heat, mostly is what I use it for. So I spray this in my hair when I get out of the shower, spray it all over, 
And then um, I comb it out with, I need to know one of these. <laughs> but I comb it out with like one of these. This is what I always use. And I've obviously had it for so long and used it so much that it's like broken, but it still works. So I just need a new one. So after I comb it out, um, I use, actually, the one that I've been mostly using is the um, smoothing Aveda one, which if you watch my first, I think it's my first video, it's a review on the product, but I just ran out of it because it's my favorite. It has to be my favorite product. So if you want to see um, which I'm talking about, then go to like my first video, it's a review on it. But I ran out, so I'm using my second favorite, which is Hang Straight from Aveda, and um, it's just a straightening lotion, and it just kind of helps smooth it out. So after I put that one in, I use this silkening gloss, I just, I love, I mostly love the way this smells, I just love the way things smell, so I use them. <laughs> but um, it's called Kenra Platinum, it's just a silkening gloss, and you just comes out like in a little drop and you barely need it, anything and I just put it in the ends just to kind of smooth out the ends and add like some shine in there and it smells so good so after that then um, I blow dry my hair and I use well I mostly take out the moisture so then after most of the moisture is gone then I section my hair in three sections watch my video on how I do all this it'll explain more um, so I section my hair and I use this brush. It's a round brush. It's kind of old, but it works so amazing. Um, I love this size. It doesn't, I just like the way it gives me some bend, not too much bend. And it's, it helps with volume too. So you can, if your hair is my length, you can use this. You could use a smaller one if it's my length. And you could use this size for pretty much any length, like my length and longer you can use this size brush. But if you're shorter than mine, then use a smaller brush because this will do nothing. Um, and that's pretty much it for now because I really, I don't use hairspray. I don't, I haven't even had hairspray in a long time. Sometimes I do, like on like a special occasion, like if I curl my hair and um, just make sure, I'm, I want to make sure my curls stay like that, then I'll spray some hairspray, but like on a regular basis, I don't use hairspray or anything else because the fact that I only wash my hair like twice a week, I don't want to use a bunch of product in my hair to weigh it down and make it even dirtier. So, um, sometimes I'll put a little more of this in when it's all dry and all done. After I like flat iron it and blow dry it and all that, then I'll just like run that through and it just kind of makes it even more smooth and then um after I'm done blow drying my hair like it's nice and straight and everything but um sometimes I just need to like make these ends a little more like sleek so I'll flat iron that I don't flat iron the whole thing I just do like a few pieces here and there because blow drying with a round brush pretty much does the job so before I use my flat iron or a curling iron if I'm gonna curl my hair. Then I use this right here, Joico. I just love Joico's products. They're so amazing. And this right here is just Silk Result Thermal Smoother. So it helps smooth it and it protects it from the heat. So I'm just gonna spray it like right before I flat iron it. And then you can comb it through, you don't have to, and just flat iron it. So, those are my daily routine products, or for my case, weekly routine products. Um, if you have any questions or anything on any of these, feel free to ask me. Uh, I feel like I'm leaving something out, but I don't know. Uh, I'll probably have more stuff later because I love trying new things all the time. And so I'll probably have new things to show you. I'll probably update this or have like a review on something but yeah i hope you enjoyed this i hope it was somewhat helpful for you i don't know so um i'll just see you guys later bye